Dang. Okay, would you like heads or tails? Uh, tails. Never did that. I would like to go first. Okay. No basics. I do have a basic. sure I'm ready to play this deck. <laughs> so your deck won the Masters and this took the second. Yep. So it's going to be a rematch kind of. Kind of, but I mean we'll see. When I played Gardevoir in the past, uh, it did not go very well for me. Stage 2 decks, I don't, I, think, I don't think it matters what era. Stage 2 decks are pretty hard. They can be. This one has a decent amount of support for it, I feel like. Basic. I'll yes. draw my one mulligan. Um, okay. cards in my hand, and if I do, I search a deck for a Pokemon and put it into my hand. Mm -hmm. So I think I'm going to discard energy and... Yeah, Diancy is kind of a... It's better if you go second, mm -hmm. because it's just a free evolution for you. It's a free Evo soda, basically, right? Yep. Yeah. You would search your deck for a card that involves one of your Pokemon and put it onto that Pokemon. Oh, that's fine. Yep. Pretty good, yeah. Like you said, going second. Mm -hmm. But I'm going first, so unfortunately, no. Yep, I found what I was looking for. So I play the Ultra Ball, I search for the top of Lele GX, and then I use the Wonder Take ability to search for a supporter, put it into my hand. Uh, Bridget, but I'm going to play the Bridget right away to search for three basic Pokemon. Or one Pokemon EX, but... Um, yeah, there, there aren't any EXs in these decks. Nope. So, I think those are the three I want to go for. Ooh. Um, I'm definitely going to go for two rolls. Okay. And um, I have a feeling that Remoraid might be dead either next turn or. I don't think you can knock it out in one turn. Mm, no, I cannot. I don't think you can either. Um, let's just get another one of the rolls. Okay. Three rolls. I don't think that's a bad play. No. Because you want to get your basics of the stage twos out as quick as yes. possible. Okay, cut it like. Mm -hmm. yep. Now I'll move that, and then I'll attach an energy return to this bench rolls, yep. and then uh, to your to your goal. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. And I had my Bridget in my hand, so I don't have to oh, wait for it. And now it can't die. Very lucky. Or if you board wipe. And if you board wipe, draft it. Now therefore it's kind of a late game setup and just one shot all my dudes basically. Pretty much. Glisspot is a little bit more quick and take early prizes. Yep. Yep, I'm in it for the long haul. You're in it to get it over with. Mm -hmm. So two completely different strategies. But of course, these strategies work, otherwise they would not be in the finals for yes. oh, yes. 2017 Worlds. Okay, I want to attach a rainbow energy to my wind pod. Do a damage to it. Yep. Um, and that is it. I will pass. Oof. All right, I'll draw. And you know what? That is not a yeah. terrible card to draw. Okay. Yeah. I think that's dead. I wish I had a rare candy in hand. That would mm. be great. Um, Seven. Seven. Oh, no. Because oh, no. now, 
I gotta wonder, do I want a vessel hand now? Or, or after you play a supporter. Yeah, or after I play a supporter. Um, but I think I want to play the supporter first. I'm going to play Anna. Okay. I feel like playing the supporter first because I felt like... Because I think, what, I have four cards in hand? Yep. So including you, N. Yeah. So if I draw one card, I'm probably not going to get much. No. But N, I have more options. Right. Hopefully. If you had, like, the rare candy in your hand, and then you drew the one, you could have drawn Ultra Ball or something into the Guard of War. Yeah. I had the... All right. If I had the rare candy, I had the Glade. Yeah. Okay. Which is not terrible. Yeah. But obviously, I want to get that Guard of War. Yes. Yeah, you want to attach as many energies this turn as possible. So each draw six, one for each prize card, we each have remaining. Okay. This is very similar. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now, I think again, I'm going to have to play. I play Ultra Ball. Okay. Discard two cards. Uh, I'm going to discard it to N. Yeah. Now these decks do play VS Seeker, so discarding your supporters isn't as big of a deal. Right. Uh, VS Seeker really changed the game. Yes. And I think both decks need to discard. Love for a large variety of supporters. Yes. One of kind of techie yeah. supporters that uh, get you out of a lot of situations. Exactly. Uh, a really common combo you saw was yeah. the VS Seeker for the Lysander yep. for game. Yep. Just nuts sometimes. Uh, let's see, Pokemon. Um, I think I might play it safe here. I'm going to get the Curlia. And I think I'm going to evolve the one with no energy. Okay. Because I want to make you decide which target you'd rather uh -huh. get. If I get a Guzma or something, yeah. Mm -hmm. Guzma is Guzma's go Yes, Glispod, yeah. Since I need to bring the Glispod from the bench to the active spot to do extra damage. Yes. Now, I really want to get the Octillery out of the active, but I don't know if I want to. How many full stones does this play? A couple. Wait, was Floatstone even a thing? Yeah, I played Floatstone, so. Maybe yours doesn't. No, I literally just saved you. Oh, that makes me sad. I don't see a floatstone in this. Oh, no. There's Guzma, but... Yeah, only two, right? Yeah, two Guzma. Oh, okay, that makes... I mean, you played double colorless, so you could attach and retrieve it manually. That's what I'm thinking about. Uh, so I think that's what I'm going to do here. Okay. Double colorless, and I'm going to pay the two a treat. And I think I'm going to... Wrap this little guy up there in case my abyssal hand does not work. Okay. Uh, so then I will use the abyssal hand for to draw up to five cards. So yep. three cards for me. One, two, and three. And yeah, I did not get a stage two or rare candy. Mm -hmm. So unfortunately, I'm going to have to pass the turn. Okay. Um, drop the turn. Yep. Okay. I'm going to evolve into the Trash Alliance Grub Order, Garbodor. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to put Floatstone on my active Trubbish, give it free retreat toss when I'm ready to retreat into a Glyph Pod, hopefully. Wait, can I cast Trash Alliance Grub? No, 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 Trash Alliance Grub. I'll put a Trace Band on that Wind Pod. Okay. So, what does that Wind Pod ability do? Oh, yes. So. If it's my first turn, the wind pod has no retreat cost, which okay. normally it's three. Yeah, but it's only good on your first turn. Yes, so if I start with it and then I bridge it a bunch of cards onto my bench, I can just retreat into something else. Yep. And what do I want to do? Oh, he's here. That ability is worthless now. Uh, I think I will have to play my own hand. Uh, that does not hurt. That does not disappoint me. Yeah. It was either VS Seeker from my own end or Sycamore away some card by 
kind of don't want to sick them away. Yeah. Before you end me, I have the ultra ball. And the lele for my turn oh. to get the ballista pod and everything running. So. so I play at the end of the right time. Yeah. Yep. Sometimes games are determined by when you play to end. Oh, yes. Pod. You like that. And I'm also going to get Ultra Ball. One pod and short spin. Yep. And I'm going to grab my other Garbodor uh, with Garbotoxin ability. Yep, and if you recall from the 2018 Worlds uh, videos, uh, you probably recall Garbodor's Garbotoxin, which gets rid of all abilities in play in the deck, discard pile, yeah. bench, uh, except for Garbotoxin. Mm -hmm. As long as I have a tool attached. Yes. But once that float stone is gone, then that ability is also gone. For now. Yes. Okay, and I will use my free retreat. Yeah. Do his first impression, so it's 30 plus 90 yeah. more if I went from the bench. So 120. Yep. Very good attack for one energy. Mm -hmm. So now, what do I want to do? I will. So I think I have the better chance of getting Gardevoir with Curlia. Right. So I think I'm going to go there. Draw. So you knock out one Ralts, I'm going to replace it with another <laughs> Ralts. Okay. Um, I like my abilities, so I'm going to use Field Blower to discard two on any combination of Pokemon tool cards okay. and stadiums and play from either myself or my opponent. You want the Trace Man too? Oh yeah, I want that gone. Alright. Well, I don't know why I would want that gone. Ah, I could put a Float Stone on that and have I a mean, retreat with that, I don't know. You could, but I feel like I want. All right, so now I can use abilities again. Um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to attach per turn, mm -hmm. and then what I'm going to use is I'm going to use a Via Seeker. Okay. Put a support card from my discard pile into my hand. That's uh, only one, I think. Yeah, besides Bridger, well, I'm not. No, gonna. you don't want. That. Nope. Uh, since it's in my hand, so I'm going to play it. Okay. I had the other fourth stone in my hand. Okay. Um. <laughs> Yeah, but I feel like the choice band might hurt me more in the long run. It could, yeah. Um, ideally, I'd be two shotting you with first impressions when you have the card wore out. Uh, but it could make a difference if I need to arm my press or something like that instead. And for cross cutting GX, for me to do 180 to knock out a Lele or something. Glessipod had three very good attacks. Yes. Uh, well, there was a good reason why Glessipod was in two decks mm -hmm. featured in this year's Worlds uh, decks. So I get five. Five. And I get six. Okay. So, we got some things cooking for us. Uh -huh. So I'm going to evolve this Curlia into Gardevoir. Yep. Right. So the next thing I want to do... I mean, at first glance with Guard War, it has two one energy attacks. So you think, how good could that be, honestly? But. Oh, pretty outstanding. Because <laughs> yeah. the infinite force does 30 damage times the amount of energy attacked to both active Pokemon. Yes, which is like X Ball. And yeah, plus, Guard yeah. mm -hmm. And plus, a Guard of War GX has the Secret Spring ability. Once during your turn before you attack, you may attach a Fairy Energy from your hand to one of your Pokemon. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah, and that's stacked. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, so, what I'm going to do next, I am going to Ultra Ball away a Curlia and a Tapu Lele GX. Okay. And with that Ultra Ball. 
Well, I'm guessing if you're just coming up curly and you probably want a Gardevoir. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm actually going to grab a Gardevoir here mm -hmm. put that in my hand. Sorry, my hand is way over here. Mm -hmm. People at home are thinking I'm cheating. I'm uh -huh. not cheating. It's just... I always like to put my hand way over yeah. here when I'm searching. Okay. That end was really good for me. Yeah. Because uh, now I'm going to rare candy. Yep. Rare candy allows you to skip a stage when you're evolving, so you can go from a basic to a stage two. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. And then now I'm going to use my active Gardevoir's Secret Spring ability to attach mm -hmm. to the active. And now my hand is empty. Now is a perfect time to use a Bissell hand yep. for five cards. Three, four, five. Four. Unfortunately, I did not get another energy to attach this turn. Because I believe I attached to the active Curlia, or the active Gardevoir, sorry, Stir. Correct? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, because you weren't sure what you were going to draw. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. So you still have one Secret Spring ability to use. Yep, which I cannot use because I play my supporter, used my ability. Um, but yeah, at this point, I'm going to use Infinite Force uh -huh. 30 times the number of energy, so I'm doing 90 damage. 30 times 3 is 90. Alright, and then we'll draw for the turn. Yep. And I'm going to evolve into a Glycer GS on the bench. Yep. Attach a grass energy. Uh oh, I don't like this. And I'm going to Guzma up that Octillery because yep. it is drawing me way too many cards at the moment. Uh, what are you talking about? Octillery is great. It's just a cute octopus. And I will first impression for the knockout. Uh, is Octillery actually an octopus? Or does it, does it have eight arms? Or does it have eight arms? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> but it evolves from a fish, so yeah. it's weird. It evolves from a... <laughs> There's a skipped evolution going on uh -huh. here. Um, so I'm actually going to put up this Gardevoir. Yep. I will draw. Are you going to play your own Guzma this turn? Um, that's, uh, that's, that could be a very good idea. Uh-huh. Uh, so what I'm going to do, let's see, I'm going to attach a double colorless energy yep. to this Gardevoir this turn. Double colorless would count as two energy yep. to a mount. So it does 60 more. Yep. And then what card I'm going to play, uh, you, you predicted correct, uh -huh. Uzma, and I want the Galissapod on the bench. Uh-huh. I will switch with this guy because Guzma allows you to switch both. Yeah. And the player that plays Guzma chooses mm -hmm. both cards. And then at this point, uh, I'm just going to knock you out with infinite force. Yes. 30, 60, 90, 120, 150 plus 90. That's a knockout. So I will draw my two prize cards. I would like to count how many items you have in your discard pile. Yeah, I completely forgot um, about. Two, yeah. three, four, five, six. Not too bad. Okay, so I wasn't really thinking about Garbodor, but I think in the back of my mind, I was kind of thinking about it. Your GX attack can shuffle in all your items, though, which I, is really good. I can, for one, uh, Fairy Energy, shuffle 10 cards from your discard pile into your deck. Mm -hmm. Okay. Alright, so I am going to play a Tapu Lele with my and use the ability Wonder Tag. Search for, I would probably guess a Guzma. Yeah, I don't know honestly what I want. Well, knowing is kind of half the battle. Yeah. And Sycamore. I'm not really sure what else. Maybe an Acerola? But no, there's no damage counters on the field yeah. for me to Acerola or anything. Mm -hmm. It would have been a good last turn. Right. But you had to play the Guzma. Mm -hmm. I definitely need a float stone this turn. Uh, or a Guzma, like I said, but I definitely want to damage the active, so we're just going to grab a Sycamore. Okay. Looking for Because four cards, I don't think I'm going to get a float stone off of. Probably not. Mono mean heck. Strange things happen. Yes, they do. Uh, I'm gonna attach a double 
propel this to the layaway just in case. Okay. Yeah. And that's something. Because Lele also has an attack similar to Gardevoir GX. But it's 20 times instead of 30. Mm -hmm. It's not affected by weakness or resistance. Correct. So it's pretty good. Takes the work. Mm -hmm. I do not like the sound. Pretty much, yeah. Magic Trubbish. I didn't even think about wheels. Catch another trubbish? Yeah, because if you're going to be leaving that guard order out this turn, um, I'll need to get some more trubbish going. Uh, I think that's all I have, so I have to pass and leave that Garbotox and Garbodor in. Yeah. Wow. And I still have my abilities. Yeah. Now. I have a VS Seeker, so I could do some shenanigans. Because I would really would love to knock out that Glissapod on the bench. Yeah. You would need another double colorless or two energy attachments to it. Mm -hmm. So, but I think I might just have to knock out the Garbodor this turn. So what I think I'm going to do, uh, I'm just going to attach a Wonder Energy from my hand okay. to Gardevoir. Uh, Wonder Energy, so I get this right, can only be attached to a Fairy Pokemon. Uh, and it only provides Fairy Energy while attached to a Fairy Pokemon. So you cannot use Secret Spring when Wonder Energy is in the hands. And also it says prevent all effects of your opponent's attacks except damage done to this Pokemon this card is attached to. Mm -hmm. So stuff like special conditions, uh, discard energy with attacks, doesn't right. affect it. Exactly. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the first Secret Spring ability to attach to this guard over okay. here. Because um, I'm thinking what I want to do... I could end, maybe give you a hand that may not be as good. But then I only get four cards. Mm -hmm. uh, so what I'm actually going to do, I'm going to play Rescue Stretcher. I'm going to shuffle three basic Pokemon from my discard pile into my deck. Three yeah. Pokemon. Three okay. Pokemon. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's those three, or I could have put just one, 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 in, hand. one into my hand. I'll just use those three, the mm -hmm. Artillery, Remorade, and a Ralts. Eight items in here now? Eight, I think that sounds about right. Seven. 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 Yeah. Seven. Seven. Last ring needs to be a sicker. That's what I was saying. Yep. Uh, so, it will be eight. Okay. I'm going to play a Sycamore, discard those three cards. Okay. Yeah, Hex Maniac was one of those tech supporters we were talking about. <clears throat> It's like Garbotox, and you just turn off all abilities until the end of your opponent's next turn. So they can't Lele, they can't... It, it, if you had nothing in your hand, and you were going first, you could just play Hex Maniac, and your opponent couldn't play their Lele. Right. Uh, so I got stuff. Uh, I'm going to Rare Candy, uh -huh. and I'm going to get a Glade. Okay. So Glade's ability is once during your turn before you attack, you may look at the top five cards of your deck and put them on top of your deck in any order. It works so well with artillery, so if you have to abyssal hand for one, you look at the top five, put the cards you really want on top, and then draw it with abyssal hand. But it's still a very good Yes, ability. for an ability, I mean, Pokedex did the same thing, but that was an item card. This is an ability once per turn. Yes. And the attack doesn't that have that either. Yeah, because it says if I played a supporter card from my hand during this turn, it would do 70 more damage. So 130. Yeah. So 130 because the base is 60 points. Mm -hmm. And you can hit some electric Pokemon for weakness or dark Pokemon, whichever. Mm-hmm. I think what I'm going to do... 
that. Actually, I'm not going to use any more spirits. Okay. Uh, I'm just going to use infinite force for the knockout. Huh? Get rid of that pesky garbage. I'm sorry, Garbodor. Because yeah. Garbodor is one of my favorite cards from the Sarah. Uh, let's see. So you have nine in there now. One short, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. With the choice band. Yep. Um, There's a reason why I didn't play any tool cards last turn. Yeah. Uh, draw for turn. I will evolve into another Garbotoxin Garbodor. Gross. But do you have the float stone? Not currently. How many cards do you have in your hand? I currently have six cards in my hand. Okay. You also forgot to use Premonition, even though we talked about I it. I did. <laughs> I got so worked up in talking about Premonition, uh -huh. I forgot to Premonition. Uh, let that be a lesson to you kids. Use your abilities. But hey, this is for entertainment and for learning purposes. Mm -hmm. And the people at home learn from my mistakes. I mean, at least you could if you wanted to retreat the Lele and attack with Glossopod if you wanted yeah, to. Yeah, but, but I'm pretty sure you can knock it out. Mm hmm. Seeker. I will play none now. Oof, man. So let's see. If N hurts both of us, or none of us, mm -hmm. or one of us. And now the premonition, if you would have used it, would have been useless now. Yep. But still. Mm -hmm. I really just need to turn your items off and do some damage to the fire river. Uh, guard for <clears throat> mm -hmm. And hope you not you don't draw any energy to knock out my close pod. Okay. So we got the float stone. We did. My abilities are gone. Um Yeah, I will discard this double colorless. I will first impression for 120. 120. Draw. I could get myself set up for an artillery yep. next turn if I shut off the Garbodor ability. You do play two field blowers, though. I do. One, on is, one is gone. Yep. Mm. So currently, I'd be doing 30, 60, 90, 120, 150. Yes. So I need. An energy and a secret spring. Mm -hmm. Or double colorless. Right. So I play, do play four double colorless. One. Two. Two have been used. Um, but I think this is what I'm going to do. Okay. I, I drew a sycamore. I did draw an energy, but I'm like, let's see what else we get. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you don't want to just attach the one and not do really attach the other. You know what else could have helped? Choice band. Yes. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Which is what I drew. And yeah. I don't have the energy now. Oh, well, I thought I could have drawn the energy. Oh, but, uh, currently, oh, that's, that's a bad day. Yeah. Bad day for a bad day. And I have no abilities. Oh, oh but this is what I think I might want. And I think it's just called hold on to my cards for now. Okay. So I'm going to use Infinite Force okay. for 30, 60, 90, 120, 150. Because I'm like, what's the point of doing 180 if I'm not not? Did you discard any items? You did, didn't you? I discarded yes, one VSC. Okay. All right. I will draw up turn. That was a pretty good draw. I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> you don't know. You're the one who knows. Um... You 
do play Acerola, so this active card of where isn't necessarily going to stick with all those energies on it and all that damage. I did play one Acerola. Yeah. I have not seen it all game. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I'm going to attach to the pelvis. Gotcha. And I am going to use my GX attack. Okay. Cross and cut GX for 150, knocking you out. And then I switch to the bench. Okay. And I'll you a Trubbish. Trubbish? How much do you think I want Trubbish? Yeah, the putting the guard board in active kind of. Well, I didn't know I was going to draw Druzma. Right. Mm hmm. <laughs> so now the question is I think I have enough items in the desk card to where you can hurt me with Garbador. Yes, but not one shot. I'm doing 200 currently, if I count it correctly. But you can have an option for a choice band. Yes. So I think that's too risky. And I think... Nine, yep, ten. So you could use your chance attack and shuffle all ten of those items back in if you wanted. I think that's not a terrible option. Because then I think I trap your Trubbish. Mm -hmm. And then also I can get the field blower back. Yes. I think that might be an option here. Because my hand is a whole lot of nothing right now. Mm -hmm. I don't know how good this is, but if you want to get a second game in, I'll let you get GX. Really hard to find. Let's use the analysis. It's really hard to find. 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 Shuffling five items? Uh, I'm shuffling five items. Okay. Yes. And then five energy. Okay. Seems important because all those just went to the discard pile. Yep. Floatstone, da 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 game. Let's see. It might be fun. I don't care if you have your hand now. Eight. That's a lot. It is a lot. But I don't know what to Yep. You want to stay up for 57 hours straight? You do you. So let's put a wood pot down. 
Okay. Really like my Ace roll now. And uh, yeah. Yeah. And twelve hours of sleep. And repeat a bunch of times. And then the last shift, we just have everybody because we can. You're right. You're first, right? Uh, yes. Can't just go. Think this is probably the best play. I'm going to Guzma up your Lele. the trash lanch. And I am going to armor press for a hundred. And then during your turn I take twenty plus damage. That's fine. Okay, I draw. That's gonna help some play. Okay. I think what I'm going to do here I think I'm going to attach mm -hmm. to the delete here. And then. Love to use an ability. Yes. But, um, I think I have to do this. Okay. I want this Garbodor. Okay. That's, that's public enemy number one, mm -hmm. I believe. And then I will take the knockout with infinite force. Okay. Yeah. Draw. And I got three S's. Yep, and that would be game. So, Guzma up the Lele. Yep, and then. And first impression for the knockout. Yep. My Israel was prized. Yeah. Otherwise, I had teammates to, to get a VS Seeker for next turn. Ah, teammates. I forgot about teammates. Mm -hmm. Well, this sounds like my whole entire game's ever playing with Gardevoir. Hey, you got three, three, no, two. I got two Gardevoirs and yeah. a Blade. Yeah. And I had one in hand because I drew the Gardevoir prizes. Yeah. So it's not like you weren't set up. Right. It's just I played like a cool. I turned you off your abilities at a bad time. Uh, yeah, yeah, that didn't help. All right, would you like to go first or second? I'd like to go first. Okay. For some reason. Jackson's Wonder Tag. Okay, yep. Yeah. Use that Bridget. There's Bridget. Look for three basic Pokemons. And I will get. But there are 20 card packs. Oh my. I want to say it's 24, so I think it's another one. Okay. Or else. Don't tell me your Remorades were both prized or something like that. Um, did find one Remoraid. Um, oh, this ain't good. This is not good. 
one memorade and two are all surprised. Mm. So this is, um, this could be a quick game. Mm, grab Diancy, I guess. That's I mean, your only, oh, yeah. Olin nope. Vulpix would probably Alolan do better. Olin Vulpix is what I'm grabbing. So the Alolan Pokemon had this interesting trait where some of them had free attacks. Yep. And this kind of harkened back to Heart Gold Soul Silver era, where baby yeah, Pokemon yeah, had free attacks, like Clefos, Eek. Mm -hmm. I think there was a time earlier than that, I think there was a Cyndaquil that had like Tackle for 10 oh, for yes. free. Mm -hmm. Something like that. So this was not a new thing, but... Comes up once in a while. Once in a while. Um, oh, this is all gross. Um, um, it's all gross, so I'm going to let you go. Okay. This is bad. I'm going to draw. Well, I will wait one to take myself. Yep. This is about normally how my Gardevoir games go. Let's see if my Bridget is even in here. Bridget is this way. So I will play Bridget. I think we both... I know I played only one Bridget in my list. I don't know about you. Yep, this yep. one only plays one. Seems a little risky to me, but... Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to grab a Wimpod and a Tapu Coco. Coco? So the Coco has free retreat. And for a double colorless, I get to do 20 damage to each of your Pokemon, which... That's a lot of damage. Can make some knockouts easier later. Uh-huh. This is really not good. You get the, the meme of the flex tape guy and going, Boy, that's a lot of damage! <laughs> um, wasn't there a meow stick or something that had an attack for where you could rearrange all your opponent's damage counters? Yes, there was. There's a there was a few ways of uh, rearranging damage counters around this time. I forget the other one. Or was that Espeon? Or was that Espeon was de-evolved a Pokemon? Yes, Espeon EX was de-evolved. Yeah. Okay. Because there were strategies where you would use Coco, spread the damage, and then I think it was Meowstic. I can't remember which one. Yeah. But it would move all the damage to like one roll, this roll, and then and then de-evolve them next turn if they were all guard wars or something like that, and then they'd be. Yep. Yep. So I use uh, Wimp Out. What? Since it's my yep. first turn, I get to use Fruit Tree. And then I will Flying Flip for 20 to all. That's flipping mad. You're flipping crazy. Uh, if you get me mad enough, I'll flip the table. Mm -hmm. Which I did around this time. <laughs> so the main reason I did that was the Lele has 150 left, and my uh, Gillespie GX attack does 150. Yep. So it's all about the math. Mm -hmm. uh, ooh. Uh, shucks, I don't have a Rokandi in hand. Also, if you can't evolve all your Pokemon, I could just knock them all out with Top Coco in two turns. Exactly. Um, next, a lot of this is gross, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to Ultra Ball. Okay. Um, I'm going to get rid of my other Lele that was in my hand to start. Okay. And my Acerola, ah. which I finally got to see this game, because mm -hmm. it was prized. Uh, no, actually I actually need to see if my Octillery is prized, because <laughs> my Octillery is prized, I'm going, yeah, it's prized. Uh, guys, it's not a good game. <sighs> That's something I should have checked with the Remory, but I was like... Uh, check your prizes, kids. This is the problem with stage two decks. They just have so many pieces that can be prized that can mess you up. Also, it doesn't help that you play one Octillery instead of two, two line. Mm -hmm. uh, at this point, I'm grabbing a Curlia. Okay. And I think I'm going to evolve the bench to yeah. the Ralts. Because I am very sad. This makes me so sad. Yeah, there's nothing really worse than ultra balling for your Lele and then it's not in there to give your supporter and you discard the supporter with the ultra ball. Right? Oh, wait, do you need this? I think I'm going to 
I'm just gonna add a new pack. Yeah, my opening hand was nuts. I had a yeah. sycamore for next turn, float stone. Yeah, I had two double colorless and a Gardevoir in my hand. I'm like, oh, yeah. this is bad. It's just my experience. These stage two decks just brick, or mm -hmm. you just yeah. can't draw some, them well. Some games, it just feels like, why is this even a deck? Right. I'm having that moment right now. Okay, so this just got better. All right. Okay, so I'm gonna play Ultra Ball. Mm -hmm. Oh man, which is sad because oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I, I want to get this done, but it's. Mm -hmm. <sighs> I don't know where I'm gonna go Who's one Sycamore? Okay. Who's one and Sycamore? We're gonna get the Gardevoir. Okay. Making sure I'm playing this right. Okay. I think I need to put pressure on you right now. Yeah. Um, you could still knock out the Coco. I'm going to knock out oh, the Coco. Oh, okay. I'm, there, there is no... I could. I'm going to knock out right, the Coco. All right. This is what's happening. Now, if I had the artillery, this would be perfect right now. Yes. Mm -hmm. Her candy. You're on the board. I'm going to use the Secret Spring ability. Yep. Attach per turn. Oh, you even have double colors. Okay. And then infinite force for the knockouts. Oh. And I'm going to hope that this prize is a Via Seeker or a Sycamore or something important. It is not important. Okay. I'm for my lying team. Put the trubbish up. It's very important. And I'm. No, I think I'm going to play a teammates. Uh, since you knocked out one of my better. Pokemon, I'm going to search my deck for any two cards, put them in my hand. Uh, to be fair, that's probably better. Yeah. Yep. Very good supporter. Putting a lot of single prize attacker decks. Um, again, this is like a tacky card because we can play BS Seeker. Mm -hmm. uh, really great combo mm. that um, was before this time was there was Battle Compressor. Yes. So Battle Compressor allowed you to discard three cards from your deck into the discard pile. So people would play would play that, get rid of a Lysander back then, which was half a Guzma. It allowed you to bring up one of your Pokemon. Opponents act to Pokemon. Uh, you put teammates in there, Hex Maniac, um, Acerola, just yeah. your techie supporter cards, and then you just use VS Secret to get them back when you needed to. Okay, so we're going to roll them into Garbodor with Garbotoxin. Put a Floatstone on it. Touch of Grass Energy. Evolve that guy into Glissapod. Uh, we'll bench another Trubbish. What a wise guy. And then... You want to play that? No. I, I played my supporter <laughs> already, sir. <laughs> uh, attach there. That's fine. So, Free Retreat with Floatstone and First Impression for 120. Active. Draw. Wow, what a top deck. Um, now I'm just debating if I want to evolve the Curly up. But the Curly hand. Oh, in hand. the Gallade, huh? Yeah, I have the Gallade in hand, and now it's like, do I play the Gallade or do I wait for a Gardevoir? Uh, artillery is gone, so I think I'm going to sick more. Okay. What a hand. <laughs> what a hand, Chris. I did get the guard work. Yeah. Okay, so 30, 60, 90, 120. Let's see, we need three more energy. energy or two in a choice band. Yep, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to attach a double of the color of mm -hmm. this. And I'm going to attach a, a band of choice. Wow. Yeah, I kind of <laughs> had a lot of stuff here. Did you discard a double colorless already in this game? Or uh, that... I think that was last game. Okay. Like that. You got like three items in there? Yep. 
which is probably going to stay that way for a bit. Um, and then I'm going to have enough force for knockout. Okay, for exactly enough. All right. Well, at least I know what my final three prize cards are. Draw. Evolve into a Carpador on the bench. Yep. Uh, I will play a heavy ball, so I switch my deck for a Pokemon with retreat cost of three or more. Yep, so Wimpod, Galissapod, Garbodor. Both Garbodors, yep. Yep. And I'll grab a Galissapod and Evolve. I will. I'm going to choice ban this Garbodor. Okay. And then now I will play him. You know I should have played the field blower. Oh, yeah. Yep, but I'm like, there's really no point right now. I might hold on to it for a turn. Yeah. But the end play was pretty darn good. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I will get six and you will go down to three. But hopefully no abilities still. Yeah. For a second I was like, wait, how do I have three? And I'm like, oh yeah, Coco. Uh-huh. You know what? I've had worse ends. Put Wimpod on the bench. Uh, Rainbow Energy. Damage on myself. And I will clear treat. Yep. First impression for the knockout. That is correct. So now, what do I do? So now you're going to need a, a lot of energy to one shot me this time. But I don't think I'm playing the one shot uh, game anymore. Right. All right. Uh, first thing I'm going to do attach return. Okay. And then, and then, and then, and then, and then, and then I'm going to play Super Rod. Yep. Shuffling three in any combination of Pokemon and energy. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm going to grab those two for sure. It was pretty common to play one Super Rod, one Rescue Stretcher. Yeah. Because Super Rod got you the energy back. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, I want the Glade. Um, let's get the energy. I think energy is going to be okay. important in this game. Okay. Now I'm hoping I remember what I saw in my desk card pile, which would help me in a second here. Be a seeker, grab the sycamore, and I'm gonna play the sycamore. Okay. Discarding the Guzma. It's like, can't really play Guzma if you don't have energy to attack with. Exactly. I mean, you could do it to like keep you stuck or something, but. Mm hmm. All right, so I think now is the time I play the field blower. Okay. So I did get the field blower, which is good. So your ability is a wreck on. Yep. I'm gonna secret spring. Yep. Attached earlier, Secret Spring. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to Infinite Force for 90 damage. Okay. So now you get 100 damage. Just like that. Yep. Alright, draw a turn. Back up Floatstone. <sighs> really? Well, you play four, so I shouldn't be too yeah, surprised. Yeah, right. Um, Yet, surprisingly. That is really surprising. Mm -hmm. um, let's do, do that and that. And then set it up for one. Yeah, I think this is the best idea. Attach another rainbow energy. Get another glossified up and running. Yeah, and then I'll sycamore. Ooh. That's fun. Sycamore way, Sycamore, Hexamania, Kenna Guzma. Yeah. Well, you said you haven't played Via Seeker yet, so. Right. Mm -hmm. Ideally, I would have gotten an Ace Rolla this turn and then just scoop that up. Right. 
Okay, so it down, it down. Did not get a Galissapod. Okay. So, an attach my energy already. You did. So, you're kind of between a rock and a hard place. Let's see. Oh, we got Get there. it? A rock. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> However, I have a rescue stretcher. You do have a rescue stretcher. Which means I can grab this gliss pod that got knocked out earlier. Oh, come on now. You, you stop it. <laughs> and evolve. And then, uh, treat, treat. Oops, got one on. And I will first pressure for 120. Alright, you do that. Almighty <laughs> top deck mode. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Oh uh, boy. Uh, again, I'm between a rock and a hard place. Mm -hmm. Ugh. I wish I kept the guard aboard here now. Yeah. But I think what I might do. I don't know if that one makes sense either. Because I have another candy and a rescue stretcher. I could get the Glaive. But yeah, but the ability is turned off right now. So. So, otherwise, it's literally Sycamore all this away. Um, I mean, you do have Gear GF's attack as well. so. I do, but. I don't want to leave my Gardevoir active. Right. Yeah, you kind of just need to knock me out this turn. Which I have to do. Yeah. I have to knock you out this turn. Uh, so attach, uh, Sycamore. Mm -hmm. Hopefully I draw the Field Blower. And Rare Candy, Gardevoir, 2 Energy. Mm -hmm. 4, 5, 6. Wow. Wow. Yeah, just finding that. Rare candy was. Uh... Uh, this is a decent poker hand. <laughs> I have a full house in my hand. Mm. A bad full house. Um, sadly, am I ready to attach my energy next turn? Yeah. Uh, I have to hit you for 150 with uh, infinite force. Uh, yeah, this is not a good one. You have two rolls and octillery prize. Right. The octillery just hurts. I could have had that. Three turns ago, I could have had it one turn to use it, but yeah. no, my hand is awful. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to play Ace for a little while. That's fair. Uh, but then pick this glitz pot up. That is fair. Yep. Put the one pot back down. Uh, how many items do you have? How many? Should be one, ten. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I count nine. Nine. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I count nine. Yeah. Okay. That's fine. All right. So I'm going to attach the rainbow to the Garbodor. And I will trash lines for the knockout this time. Yep. Yeah. Um, this is all sorts of bad. I will say this every single set that he brought to us was not But I think at this point I have, I have to try to go for the win, but. Mm hmm. All right. This is so bad. How bad is it, Hunter? <laughs> uh, it's that bad. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Three VR Seekers, three Fairy Energy, and ending a double color. So it's like. 
30, 60. It's, I have to attach the Lacola, so I can't yeah. knock out the vault. I can't knock out the Garbodor. Yeah. And then I, and I might not. Uh, no, you don't want to add. Yeah, seeker. <laughs> you're, you're not gonna get all you need off three cards. Yeah, that's. I was like, no, stop. I'm sick of more. <laughs> yes. Okay. <laughs> Oh, yes, they are gone. <laughs> Two, three. Sometimes you just have to do it, though. Five. At any rate, these are going to come apart. I didn't get it. Uh, I didn't get it. Oh, this is. Um. Yeah, so this one would be four seven. Yeah, this is just all sorts of bad. Yeah. I think I'm just bad. Well, I guess let's just fight. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Uh, I have to retreat. Yeah. Have a Vulpix. Okay. You can beacon. I can beacon. These are the boxes. Hold on, I have all the Pokemon in my hand. Oh. Beacon. Okay. I guess let's just yeah. get something out of here, I guess. So I'm going to get a Lele and a Curlia and. <laughs> Yeah. Are there two rare candies in there? There's still? one. Oh, okay. So, I mean, that's, there's that's one rare candy. I just don't know what we're doing with that. What we're going to do is just sell them as is. Yeah. And then, for the ones that we take the car, I'll take them. And, uh, yeah, now it's your Okay. That'll probably take me about just to take it apart. Draw. Now no, you're just going to end me. Yeah. Hurt you. No. <laughs> you're out. Well, no, you're going to. You're gonna attach your energy, Guzmo win. No, I don't have that either. Really? Yeah. I'm gonna attach an evolve. Um, yeah, I think I just trash lunch. I think you do too. Yeah. And now I have to. What do I got? So, we get our Gardevoir. Okay. We got a Choice Band. Uh -huh. We got Field Blowers. I know they're coming. Yeah. Now, the only support I have in my hand is N. Hmm. So, to get rid of stuff from my hand, Bench. Bench. Um, actually, uh, how much is in here? Ugh, grossness. <laughs> I guess what we'll do, we'll wonder tag. Okay. See what's in here. Um, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, because. Yeah, 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 you're good. I mean, I could grab Sycamore, but it's like, then I lose the game next turn. Right. Mm -hmm. Um, so at that point, I'm just going to play N. Okay. Because I can't want to go to work earlier. Yeah. Desperate mode. How many energies were in there when you left? Uh, three. There's at least two fairy energy in here. Yeah. So I can't remember. There's a double colorless in here or not. There could be. Mm -hmm. But we're in desperate mode. Did you use your artillery? No, it's prized. Uh, artillery and two rolls. I guess I'm from force. Yeah. Just, just do something. This, this game is basically over. Yeah, um, we'll double count how many items you have in your discard pile just to make sure. I count 13. That's, yeah, that's that, enough. That's enough. Yeah. So I would just trash my edge for the knockout. Yep, but that would. Yep. Two cards I drew. Ultra Balls. What was the next card? Yeah. Still, you need to double color less. Yeah. You, know. you want to see the roll from the artillery? Mm. 